I'm Juan, and this is PedalsAndEffects.com, and I'm going to talk about the most important pedal in uh, my career, and it's this Boss Compressor Sustainer. It's the CS2 that they don't make anymore, and it's a uh, three-knob level sustain attack, and uh, I just use it to bring out the harmonics and bring out a lot of the articulation that you don't always get when you don't have it on. So when when I go like this, even, and you can hear the string noise, when you kick on the compressor sustainer, you get everything. Uh, it's a lot harder to work with sometimes to be able to keep your articulation clean, and, but it, it, there's a lot of that sound that I really feel is vital to what I do. And so I'm always turning this guy on to get... That's really why when I was younger and I went to it, it's because I wanted harmonics like these to pop out. I did that without the compressor sustainer. If I did that without no compressor. I mean, you can hear it, but it's not going to ring out. And it's also, I want it to be gained out a little so it has a little bit of bump. But also, I want, it, I want it to be the same level as the rest of my notes on my instrument. So when I hit harmonics, they're just as prominent as any other note that I hit. That's the idea behind compression. Uh, the reason I use this one is because it also adds a little bit of high end, which I really love. It's a, it's a natural high end. So when you do do harmonics, it really pops those guys out. hear how it almost makes it a fluid chord and that's you know the magic behind that they the, you can't buy the new ones and get that sound as well because they don't have the same chip so really this is something that boss just nailed early on in the late 70s early 80s they were making these great compressor sustainer pedals